Silvertone song came from was one of the first songs that Zach and I wrote, and it was、um, something that we, we kept like, oh yeah, oh there's that instrumental thing we need to get to. We finally put some finishing touches on it, and it just it's a really creepy mood, and、uh, it just reminds me of something that it reminds me of something that like. Atticus would put in a movie or something like that. You know, it sounds like something in the soundtrack, with such a solid rhythm section and Billy Gould and, and Brooks bring、um, on the record. It really, you know, left me to be able to, to sort of put those dreamscape sounds of guitar in, and really, I got really into like the whole echoey reverb thing and well, a bit more of a clean sound, and I wanted to, you know. Use them more of a standard tuning and, and classic guitars and Fenders and Gibsons and、um, there's even some acoustic guitar on it and it's it's just a, it was a lot of fun doing and using all that old vintage stuff. I think the music on the next record will be probably a, a, a less structured. And I think a little bit more experimental, especially with because we had all the music written, and then Steve came in and sang on everything. So this record would be definitely more, you know, collaborating together and writing together as a band, and sort of just like bits and pieces and putting everything together. So I think it'll be a deeper, heavier, more meaningful record. Since the vocalist and the, the guy that writes the lyrics is going to be involved in every note written, and that's really going to pull you into the direction he wants you to, instead of having to follow somebody else's direction where where the path of the music is going to take you. I I have some songs written. They're not complete songs. They're just ideas.、Um, but I think I, th- I think there might be some pieces of music. Within some of the songs, because I'll, I'll write something and then I'll go. Is that more of a, you know, could I use that for corn, or is it, you know, is it something I could use for? Is it more alternate, alternative sounding, and then I could use it for that? But, or is it just crap? And should I just throw it away and not let anybody hear it? So there's three categories. I think that there's new ground to be conquered with corn, you know. And I also feel like with the Fear and the Nervous System project, I can, you know, do more of a, an alternative rock sort of indie feeling、um, thing, you know. So there's many doorways I can I can choose when I'm working. <laughs> The last good movie I saw was Prometheus. I just saw that on the plane, but I wanted to, I, I got to see it again because I got to see it on the, on the big screen. It just it makes the puzzle sort of complete. I, I, I thought that movie was unreal. Like I kept, I even got out of like、uh, out of my chair in the plane and went over to Jonathan and said, "Hey, dude, you got? Have you seen Prometheus?" He's like, "No." And I go, "You got to watch it. It's on." I almost like leaned over and pushed his little TV. 